Hey, what's going on, guys? Here to talk about a couple of player props I like for the NBA slate on Saturday. If this is your first time watching, my name is DK. I do cover content for Prize Picks as well as DraftKings. DraftKings being NBA and NFL. If you guys are playing the NBA five game main slate, you can check my video for that. And uh, yeah, let's get right into this video. So let's recap the plays from yesterday. Went two for two. So I hope and keep the hot streak going. Two plays I gave in the YouTube video were Trey Young more than 27 and a half and RJ Barrett more than 30 and a half fantasy score. Uh, the RJ was a little bit of a sweat because that game turned into a blowout. And I was like, am I really going to get hooked by RJ? Because I had him, I quote unquote, nuked him, bruh. I had RJ in a lot of slips, but uh, yeah, he went over. That was very, very nice. Um, these were the six picks I gave total. Went four for six overall. Um, Siakam just, it was the Van Fleet game. And then Miles Turner, no blocks or steals. Like, how is that possible? But yeah, four for six, not a bad day. It was a very profitable day overall. And hoping to keep that going here for this slate. Again, if you guys look for more picks, I, I do post those on patreon.com. And if you guys are looking for uh, DFS content, I have uh, packages there. Also, if you're a first time user for prize picks, you can use the code DKDFS for a 100% match up to $100. All right, so let's start off with the first pick. And we're going to go to PRA and we're going to go Porzingis, a guy that I've been very high in this year. I have him in most of my best ball teams. But I think this number is a little bit too high 36 and a half PRA. We're going to take less than 36 and a half PRA. The reason is it sounds like Brad Beal is going to be back. Um, I have um, up here, let's see. So he went through, uh, he practiced, he fully participated in Friday's practice. Um, so I would say that there's a decent chance he does play. Um, and with Brad Beal back, obviously that's a downgrade just to Porzingis and Kuzma usage wise, because Brad Beal's going to get his. So while Por Porzingis has been playing extremely, extremely well, and you know has been hitting this number recently, this is a little bit of a different story now with Beal back. So uh, I'm going to take less than 36 and a half PRA for Kristaps Porzingis. And uh, the other player we're going to go to is for a team that now is really, really shorthanded. I think this number is a bit too low. Tim Hardaway Jr., we're going to take more than 16 and a half. So we just got news. Luka Doncic is out. Spencer Dinwiddie is out. Um, they have like half their team out. Um, no Luka, no Dinwiddie, no Kleba, no Josh Green, no Dwight Powell. Um, yes, Christian Wood's going to get his, but Tim Hardaway Jr. is going to be one of the go-to guys offensively. You know, they might be starting like Kemba Walker. Maybe they go to their rookie, Jaden Hardy. But either way, I mean, the offense is going to run through Wood and Hardaway. There's no props up for Christian Wood yet, but Tim Hardaway Jr. is going to be one of their main guys offensively. And he's going to get a ton of shots up. Like That's literally what he does. He's score independent, but... Now, with no Luka and no Dinwiddie, uh, a lot of the offense is going to run through him. I have him right now projected for about 18 and a half points. So, uh, getting decent value here. And, uh, yeah, the opportunities are going to be there. I think my only real concern is that this game blows out. Like, maybe Cleveland just wipes the floor with Dallas and Hardaway only plays three quarters. That's really my only concern. But if this game is competitive, you might see 20 plus shots here for Tim Hardaway Jr. So, those are going to be the two picks that I like for today, guys. Porzingis, less than 36.5 PRA, and Tim Hardaway Jr., more than 16.5 points. I'll be posting more plays over on Patreon. Um, but yeah, that's going to wrap up the video. So if you haven't enjoyed the prize picks content, make sure to like, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and I'll see you guys in the next video.